I'm just here to try to connect the other spirits as well. Meet Mr. McKenzie. Is there any other spirits here? And Mr. McKenzie would like to speak to us. I'd like to speak to all spirits of the cemetery, please. Maybe he's want to light the meter up for me. Show me that he's are here. My name's Drew. I'd like to know your name, please. I do not like that. Is there any wee kid spirits here want to light the meter up? Can you hear it beep? Just don't get a fright. Okay? It won't harm you. Because you hear the police. Is that what I have to run for? Mr McKenzie, remember I told you my name? It's Andrina. My friend called me Drew. And I asked you if we would, could be friends. If you tell me your name, I would consider us friends then. I really would like to know your name. Would you like to light my meter up? Try your hardest, please. All you need to do is go near it. Affecting the meter, please. In fact, that that's but that's going to be the there's a sun care done now. It needs to be free for it. Sorry, guys, that's all debunked with the K2 because there's a sun care done that tablet. It's all debunked. So ignore the K2. Good catch, Drew. Nice integrity. Good job. Let us know if you're in Mr. McKenzie's tomb, please. Are you one of the strangers that's buried in his tomb? No. No. I won't throw my doubts down. I'll put them in my pocket. I'll be respectful, thank you. Okay? I'd love you to say my name, and it's only just for validation that you are here. If you say Drew or Andrina, then I'll believe you're really here. <laughs> Disprove that. Go ahead. <laughs> I definitely heard your message the last time I was here. I heard you say it was a hard life when you were alive. Team members talking in the background discredits any evidence you may catch. Thus, we cannot use this. A beautiful starry night. Try using the energy at the atmosphere. Oh. I'll take you a wee walk. See what we can get. Steve. Steve. Oh, you see. Steve or Steve? See? Who's Steve? Is that Steve or she? Well, we're going to end up at the castle and see if we can speak. Well done. Walking away from the group is respectful, plus it puts you back on the playing field, as you just saw. Hi everybody, it's Drew's Paranormal here again. My name's Andrina. Do you remember I came up here once before? And I could have swore that you spoke to me. You were actually talking to me a couple of things. You told me it was a hard life. When I asked you what it was like a way back then, you told me it was a hard life and different things. Would you like to tell me a wee bit more about your life up here a way back when? I bet you were really sad if some of it was your husband's. Is it the elements? Is the elementals making it windy? Yeah. Yeah? Do you like? Do you like the fact that Christopher goes ghost hunting and wants to talk to you? Yes. So he's, are you proud of him? Are you proud of him that he comes and looks after all the family's graves? Even the ones in the other cemetery he looks after. Is that nice of him? Yeah, we won't be long till we're leaving. We're just up I'll a visit. We're just up a visit. 
And I thank you for speaking to me, I really do. Thank you very much. Well, I'm going to say goodbye then, Spirits. Could you say goodbye back to me? The batteries are flashing. Thank you for speaking to me, okay? Right, I'll speak to you again soon. Thank you. Goodbye. Here on the 14th May 1968, within a mile of the spot where the 26th Cameronian Regiment was raised by the Earl of Angus on the 14th of May 1689. The 1st Battalion Cameronian Scottish Rifles held a covenantical and Lord Regimental flag to mark its disbandment and orders of the government. Erected by Lanarkshire County Council in token of its high regard for the distinguished services of their country regiment during nearly three centuries, the memorial was unveiled by Colonel the Lord Clyde Muir, CB, MBE, TD, Lord Lieutenant of Lanarkshire. There you go, guys. It's basically a memorial to... Oh, oh look. There's all the pictures. See, that must be like all the pictures of the people that's died, that used to serve their country. What a beautiful honour to them, eh? Blessings to the fallen. LSSR, boys. LSSR. Where Mackenzie's tomb is for the black shadow that I saw, which is basically... We were standing at Mackenzie's tomb, the notes behind me, and the black sh I saw the black shadow when I walked down round here, all the way down there, and I saw the black shadow round about there. So, maybe you don't believe that it was a black shadow, but please, if you've got the ability to slow it down and look, please do that. The iron mortar safe was placed over the grave to prevent grave robbers from digging up the body for sale to the anatomy classes in the medical school. Many other measures were taken in this 18th century and 19th centuries to prevent this repulsive trade, which continued until the Anatomy Act was passed in 1832, restored in 2010 by the Greyfriars Kirkbrook Yard, Trust with support, sorry guys, with support from the Edinburgh World Heritage Trust. There you go, the grates obviously been put on folk to stop the grave robbing. Eh? Thank you, our goddess, for keeping us blessed, keeping us happy, keeping us here on this earth another day, looking after our loved ones that's passed. Blessed be. Thank you. Hi, everybody. I don't mean you's any harm. If you want to speak, just speak on the camera and I'll hear your voices. We've got a beautiful, peaceful graveyard here. Uh, this is my Santa Mort altar that I redid it all. If you see, this is, I'll just explain some. This is oil that I get made up for Santa Mort personally, and I keep that on the, the pentagram on the world so that it's always flowing love into this oil from me to her. This is all my either two or three tubs of herbs, Freya's Cauldron. Do you know what I mean? I've got every herb near enough in the book. All the ones that you can buy. And she makes you up mixes for like Beltane. I've got Wormwood. I've got near enough everything. I don't really want to get through everything. Look, this is actually really nice. She makes up a Maybon hair blend and you just burn that in your cold room and you're doing your offerings and things. That's for a poppet doll. That's actually supposed to be in that box because that's for like things in my sage. I've got some damar resin that you burn on your cold room when you're doing certain things. What else have we got here? This is all my books. So this is the best book you can ever buy if you want to become a witch and figure out spells and things is the alchemist book. A complete idiot's guide to alchemy. And listen, I'm not going to go through all these because these are actually my book of shadows and I would be here for a week. But if you want, I might do a edited version of that. These are just empty boxes. That's my pe pestle. That's actually supposed to be in the altar, but I've no room for it at the moment. Plus, it needs emptied. I ring this bell when I want Santa Marta to give me extra special attention. If I'm if I'm maybe in a prayer and I feel as if I need an extra boost, I'll ring the bell.
Can you see on that, folks? It smells really old. Don't mean you any harm. Thank you. Very, very musty smelling. Definitely very musty smelling in there, people. Really nice, but Try to get a feel for the place, people, right? And I'll bring out the meter. I'm Drina, my friends call me Drew. You're welcome to call me either. Can you try speaking to me, please? I don't mean you any harm, I would just like to communicate with you, maybe a bit to tell me your story, why you scratch people. Can you tell me why you scratch people? I would really like to know your story. I really would like to hear your side of the story, why you scratch people. My understanding of why he scratches people is because they hurt him. In other words, they don't show him respect and they disrespect him, which hurts his feelings, so he scratches. And I would be actually honoured if you touched me. I wouldn't be scared. I would be honoured if you would touch me. I'd be scared. <laughs> Can you touch me in my head? I actually think we could be friends. Because I'm misunderstood as well. Do you get a lot of tourists coming to see your uh, tomb? My name's Drew. I'm actually called Andrina. I want to be your friend. So does Tiami, she just said. She wants to be your friend too. Will you be our friend? And we'll keep coming back and speaking to you. I promise that if you keep talking to us, we'll keep coming back. This is actually where I did see the dark shadow guys, is right here. Tell me why there's a dark shadow here, please. Can you try to tell me who the dark shadow was? Try to tell me who the dark shadow was, please. So there you have it everybody, Drew Spiderham Normal Vlogs. Uh, the only advice I'd give is when you're out and you're doing hunts, whoever else is with you, whoever's doing the communication, everyone else must stay quiet. Uh, you're not, you cannot talk because you contaminate your evidence. Other than that, bang on, keep up the good work. I'll check mine, see. Yes. 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 Yes.